What's up, friends? It's Cali One, Damien. Um, we are at another school. This one uh, is heavily boarded up, so that's the reason for the miner's hat, so I can freaking see, and hopefully you can too. Um, so let's go explore. Yeah. What? It's way more powerful than your headlamp. Yeah. So I can't oh, see. Oh, here we go. Actually, yours not so bad either. Yeah. You still have it on. All right. So here is the oh. auditorium, gymnasium, and lockers. Oh wow, that's well lit now. Oh. I think I've seen. I'm not sure. I've seen plenty of pictures from here. Yeah. So, uh, this auditorium is pretty cool. Um, it's not burned, which is a good thing, because that happens a lot. And um, a lot of the seats are still intact. And uh, it's in good condition with just the right amount of decay. someone can comment in the comments section if they know what this is but if you look under the seats there's just these little discs that look like bells and I do not know what they were for So if anyone knows, I would love to hear. So if I put it up, you'll see a photo I took from here. It used to be stuffed animals in the front row. Just made it a little extra creepy. This is a very cool school for its auditorium. And then also, it's two gymnasiums we'll get to, and it's pool. So best guess is, my theory is, if you look at this, which is basically that thing without the cover, um, they're probably some sort of venting system for heat. Um, you can see those are the air vents for the air conditioning, or to recirculate the air. And then there's no baseboards or anything for heat so I imagine they pumped the heat in through these holes poured out from what looks like what used to be the radiators over here against the walls you can see the gas line and then you can also see the lines of from the radiators when they used to be there I don't know, let me know what you think in the comments. Yeah, yeah.
stairs in the auditorium. This is the old projector room. upstairs. Hmm. There's not much to it. It's just a wide open room. Mm -hmm. We can go if you want. But... Is there anything else in here? Yeah. Mm -hmm. We are in one of the two gymnasiums. Uh, watch out for nails. It's got an upper level for people to sit and watch. And a ladder for the uh, courtside seats. Oh my god, that how that netting. That's impressive that that netting is still there. It's got rust spots on it, little staining, but it's still here. And not cut up or anything. Like you usually find they're just gone. More places where the radiators used to be. Obviously taken by the scrappers for all the metal. So yeah, this whole place was installing radiators in probably all the major rooms. All right, so this was the first gymnasium. And then here is the second gymnasium. Um, my thought is here, which I'm not 100% sure about, feel free to comment below if I'm wrong. Um, they separated out probably the girls and the boys. Um, I know in some of these schools I've been in, there's two pools, a uh, girls and a boys pool. And especially back in the day, from what I understand is um, boys used to swim naked because sometimes there's the material from their suits was bad and it'd fray and it'd get caught up in the, the draining of the pools and block them. And so the drains would get clogged. So the boys would swim naked and the girls um, would swim naked in the other thing. So they separated them out. Whether that's really true or not, I haven't researched it yet. Feel free to comment. And that is a creepy noise. That 
metal rolling. So now obviously the boys and girls didn't play gym, gym class naked, but I think they separated them back in the day. Most common graffiti in bandos is dick art. Dudes are just dumb sometimes. Chalkboards are all falling down. This place too is losing its chalkboards. Oh jeez, that thing fell in. Well, there's some leftover toilets. Yeah, that just fell from water damage, I bet. Just. I think this thing was a hall monitor station. <laughs> they sat in this and like watched down both of them. One of the major hallways and also maybe administrator just to in case anything went wrong. That's the longest. Here we go. This pool, it's almost like it's a cave. It's one of my favorites just because, watch your step because the stairs are breaking. Um, because the ceiling, can you get your light on the ceiling? So yeah, I love the, and the shape of this place. And the ceiling beams and all that, it makes it look very cool. I don't know how much you'll be able to see because I know it's super dark. It's six feet deep. And then there's the ceiling. And, you know what? Because this area is so dark, come here with me and Damien. I don't think I knew this or looked because we always wound up going here. Oh, no. Probably just locker rooms, yeah. Damn it, I thought I was gonna find another pool. But here are the gym locker rooms for the pool and the gym. I've never looked for before. Look at these tiny little lockers. Holy shit. And all the caging. I thought I was gonna find a second pool, but this one doesn't have a second pool. So probably a quick way from upstairs to get to gym class, or you just came the other way.
showers, probably. Maybe. All right, watch your step. You can see that corn is gone. All right. I don't know if you can see me, but we are about to leave the dark room now. Actually, I changed my mind. Let's shoot it. All right. I want to shoot it from that end, though. Yeah, that's fine. All right. All right, we're going to pause for a station identification break while he takes some long exposure photos. Oh, this is all the shower stalls. The shower stalls. They're tiny. What's left of the shower stalls? All right, let's go. All right, let's film. shoot and we are making our way out um. All right, so this is Kelly One and Damien. And we are leaving the abandoned school. We hope you had a good time, and we will see you in the next video. Please like, comment, and subscribe.